Hey everybody, it's Will here again. Hope y'all are doing well, and today I want to bring you another groovy guitar review from my personal collection. Hope you enjoy. Today we're taking a look at the 2018 Gibson SG Special P90 Limited. This guitar came out uh, late 2018. It was ostensibly a modern day recreation of the 60s Gibson SG Special which was kind of their, I guess, midline uh, model in the series in the day. Uh, for years, they've been using the SG Special name on guitars that are modern-day SGs that don't share very many similarities to the original. So it was nice to see Gibson pay a tip of the hat with this model in the standard USA range. As far as specs go, it's a fairly standard SG in a lot of ways. You've got your mahogany body, mahogany neck, rosewood fingerboard. In this case it's a bound rosewood fingerboard with the dot inlays. This particular model does have the gold silkscreen logo and the Clusen tuners with the white plastic tips. Uh, it's got two P90 pickups, regular P90s. They're not noise cancelling or anything. Your single piece uh, wraparound or wrap tail bridge two volumes, two tones, and a three-way toggle switch. The weight of the guitar is probably around six and a half pounds, so it's a great light stage guitar, and uh, I play this one a lot. I really enjoy it. So this model, uh, it originally came in two colors for the 2018 run, and that was vintage sparkling burgundy, which you see here, as well as a really cool kind of a faded Pelham blue. This model was actually so successful that in 2019, for Gibson's original collection, they, they brought the model into the range with a few spec changes. Um, the two major ones that I've noticed that make this particular model, the 2018 Limited, differ from the 2019 original collection are that these controls on the 2018 are a PCB circuit board mount as opposed to discrete handwire components. And I believe the nut material used is different as well. Uh, this would have whatever Gibson was using at the time. I believe it was called Tectoid. And the newer models, I believe, just use like a Graftech nut. The, an interesting fact about the original SG Special is that it was the first guitar of this design to bear the actual SG or solid guitar name. Up until 1963, many of the guitars made using this shape, including the SG Les Paul Jr., the SG Les Paul Standard, the SG Les Paul Custom, didn't actually have SG in the name. They just had this body shape, but were still called Les Paul models. This happened until 1963 when Les had his name removed. But interestingly, the 2P90 wrap tail version with the dots and the bound fingerboard from day one was always called the SG Special. I'm not sure the reasoning behind this at Gibson, but uh, it's an interesting anomaly in the history of the SG model guitars. Some of my favorite players that use these are people like Pete Townsend of The Who, Zal Clemenson of the Sensational Alex Harvey Band, and even some various other people. I know Tony Iommi used a, an SG Special with custom, I believe they're John Birch pickups in there. And there were numerous other great players that have played these. You can even see a white one being prominently played by David St. Hubbins in the movie This Is Spinal Tap. Anyway, one last look here. An interesting thing about this color... Um, it's a very different finish to that of Heritage Cherry, which is kind of the standard red shade that you see on 90% of Gibson SGs. This is called Vintage Sparkling Burgundy and was actually a color option on many Gibson guitars back from about the mid to late 60s. So it was interesting to see them bring that color back for this model. Anyway, thank you for taking the time to listen to this discussion portion, and I hope you enjoy hearing some sound samples of the 2018 Gibson SG Special P90 Limited. <laughs> 